Good morning, everyone. It is a pleasure to present my speech today in front of you all. I am Meghna El Nair, and I'm going to talk about electricity and its importance in everyday life. Can you imagine a day without electricity? Maybe not a hard task, it seems. But how about a week or a month? It is impossible for this generation to live without electricity. But do remember that there were times in the past centuries when people lived without electricity. Electricity is a form of energy. Michael Faraday, a British scientist, and Benjamin Franklin, an American scientist, were two notable persons who have a major role to play in understanding the nature of electricity. There are also Nikola Tesla and Thomas Elva Edison who contributed to the invention of electrical products like bulbs, generators and power stations. Electricity is the cheaply generated using water power, sunlight or other mechanical processes. So it is called in different ways as hydroelectricity, biogas, solar, wind power, and more. Today, electricity is used in every household as lights, fans, electrical equipments, and more. We get heat and power from the electricity and is used for many purposes. Transportation and entertainment are yet other uses of electricity today. We can see trains, cable cars and trolley buses using electricity daily to run to places. Also, television, radio and mobile phones are designed to work using electric power. The computer age is nothing without electric power. We cannot imagine a moment without electric power. We cannot imagine a moment without electricity as it brings great difficulty and inconvenience. Indeed, that is what made electric energy very important in the modern world. Though electricity is useful, there are times when it has to be handled with care. Any misuse or overuse can lead to fire, shock or even fatal consequences. So, electricity is useful servant and a dangerous enemy.